Minecraft is a really fun game to play, but it kind of gets boring after a while, so it's up to us to introduce new things into the Minecraft community in order to make the game seem fresh and new and kind of have a lot of fun stuff that you can always enjoy. And one of the easiest ways to change the game to make it seem a lot newer is by, you know, changing your texture pack, changing the appearance of the game. And honestly, texture packs or resource packs are honestly such a great part of Minecraft because no other game really offers this much customizability in the textures and stuff like that. So, you know, th that fact fact that you can change it to look like bubblegum or it can look like a uh, really HD graphics or something like that and it's actually not that bad so overall texture packs can actually be really fun to have and make the experience just a lot fresher and a lot more enjoyable on the flip side of that you also have the texture packs that make you want to die on the inside because it makes the game look like it's having an aneurysm and you know as much as I love to introduce new faithful 128 times red edits onto my channel I think that overall the experience of having a really crappy texture pack is just a lot more entertaining maybe for you guys not for me not for me in the slightest so that's gonna be the aim of this series that I'm gonna try to keep up with I'm gonna download a bunch of really crappy texture packs and then experience them with you guys because what's the best thing that you can do with a crappy texture pack share it with your subscribers and by the way if you haven't subscribed already I would really appreciate it uh, shameless plug in right in the middle of the video who cares but to start off with the first episode of this potential series I decided to choose one thing that I actually enjoy anime. And before I get all the comments that are like, oh my god, you're such a weeb. You know, if you've never watched even like an episode of Naruto or Dragon Ball Z or Pokemon, then then you're living life unexposed. And that's not even like the best animes out there. There's a ton of really good animes that are just really fun to binge watch, right? I take I take no shame in saying it. You know, overall, if you like anime, the anime community is actually a really fun community to be a part of. But what we're going to be doing basically is we're going to be taking the anime community and we're going to be smashing it head on with the Minecraft world. So basically in this video my game is gonna look like if Minecraft and anime had a baby and that baby had autism and a bunch of other birth defects because this is gonna be completely horrible and I haven't even looked at the texture pack but I know it's gonna be horrible so basically what I've got here is because I didn't want to ruin any animes that I actually enjoyed from start to finish I'm gonna instead be choosing a texture pack for Sword Art Online which deserves no introduction because it's Sword Art Online all right so here it is the moment of truth oh also this is made for uh, 1.12 it's actually not meant for my version of Minecraft, but who cares? You know, I, I think it'll work. Oh boy, here we go. Here it is. First exposure to the Sword on the Line texture pack. Right, oh god. <laughs> oh god. Oh, there's game sound too. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, this is gonna be horrible. It's so bright. Oh, the bottom of the screen. Oh no. I've made a grave mistake. <laughs> my banner what is on my head <laughs> oh god so here it is sort of online in my just look at this title screen let, let that sink in for a moment if you already don't want to kill yourself then don't worry we're going to be getting into a game of skywars momentarily but just kind of take this in for a sec you know all i need is a vr headset and i'll be completely set it'll be like sort of online is in real life all right here we go moment of truth number two we're gonna go ahead and join a freaking game of Skywars. Oh god, this is gonna be... I, I don't even know what's actually in the tech... Oh god. <laughs> Look at this kit selection right here. Um, We're gonna go random, just because I couldn't think of anything. Um, But, you know, <laughs> I haven't actually looked at anything about this texture pack. I've just known that it's the Sword on the Line texture pack, so there could be like sound files or something that I wouldn't even know of. I'm just gonna hear them in the background and just be like, why am I alive? So... Uh, a little bit of background, I started watching Sword Online, um, I think in 2017, but I stopped, like, after, like, the first season, because I was like, this is going slightly downhill. It was originally good near the beginning. I, I don't want to spoil things too much, but this is just kind of my review of the anime as a whole. Obviously, it gets crappier near the, uh, later seasons. I don't actually, I haven't actually watched them, but I do know of them. So, you know, I don't think, I, I don't think I, that's on my bucket list exactly, but yeah. All right, well, we're gonna go ahead and uh, PvP. This is it, everyone. Sword online, everyone. Oh, oh, oh! Kill streak. I am the new Kirito, dude. Epic PvP. Look at me. Uh, I, I don't actually remember that much stuff about you know the anime as a whole. I don't. I just remember there was like this, like a bunch of this, like a uh, Asuna, right? She's like his his wife or something like that, or girlfriend. I don't even know. It, it goes so many places in the anime that you know you might as well just. 
just call it quits and say they're all basically in love with one another because that's what it feels like. There's like that one lolly or whatever that's like <laughs> in, in one of the uh, earlier episodes. I forget. Um, and then there's his sister or something like that. <laughs> Again, I it's been so long since I watched it and I don't plan on watching it anytime soon. So a lot of weird people. Oh my god, I won the game. I was gonna say, a lot of weird people, you know, like, buy, like, Asuna body, body pillows, and I think the only reason that a lot of people buy Sword Art Online merch is because it is Sword Art Online. So, you know, just the fact that it is really a meme in and of itself in the anime community, that's kind of why I get, I guess a lot of people like it. But me, personally, I try to distance myself as far as possible from the Rule 34 community, and let me just say, there exist bots out there whose sole purpose is for posting uh, Rule 34 submissions for Sword Art Online. I don't know what it is. But in case you're ever in an anime-themed Discord and are wondering why Sword Art Online has the reaction and image that it does, that, that's pretty much the only reason why. But in terms of anime just as a general subject, you know, there's actually a ton of really good anime out there, and because it's 2019, there's just a ton of different anime subjects, I'm sure you can find an anime that you might enjoy, even if you've never watched an anime before. Please go away, friends. Thank you very much. Rad. Alright, well time for the janitor of a lifetime gg <laughs> oh god and the variety of topics is just insane you know let's suppose that you are into volleyball and you want to watch an anime based on volleyball well there's an anime for that let's suppose that you're into you want an anime about a cafe well there's an anime for that let's suppose that you want uh, an idol group anime well there, there's a ton of animes for that actually uh, let's suppose that you want an anime for idol groups but instead of like an actual idol group all of the members are dead there, there's an anime for that uh, let's suppose that you want an anime about, you know, bands and stuff like that, or rock bands, whatever. There, there's an anime for that, in fact, there's two, um, and I actually do play Bang Dream Girls Band Party, which is the, uh, iOS game for Bandori the anime, and it, it's overall, just as a community and as a musician, that's how I got into it, that's why I like it so much, so, you know, this is a direct experience on how I was influenced by, you know, anime, because I, I watched it since I was a musician, I was like, this is, this is pretty good, this is pretty good, just, just that wide diversity though you know you got the fighting animes you got the idol uh, life i don't know what they're called animes you've got you've got fighting animes you've got you know like story based animes uh, animes based on video games animes based on real life even freaking animes based on the damn human body there's an anime for that so that moral of the story just like there's just a wide variety of of animes and i'm sure that if you've never watched an anime you can find something that you'll enjoy now if this dude could fight me that'd be great all right let's oh my god i'm so laggy no oh uh, i'm gonna die but whatever it's fine legendale what a guy i started lagging near the end that kind of sucks i'm just gonna go ahead and stop this here because i need to get this this texture back off it's it's just killing me on the inside. It's so bright. I don't know. I don't know if that's just me. Maybe I have a problem. Ah, relief, relief. Back to the regular texture pack. I don't know. That texture pack was just so weird. And not only that, it brought me back to Sword Art Online, which is which is horrible. So yeah. But anyway, send me your ideas for really bad texture packs, and uh, I'll do episodes on them if I decide to continue the series. But I'm really bad at series and stuff like that. So you guys gotta add suggestions and stuff like that, and then I'll and then I'll make the episodes for them. But Hopefully you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.